Jamie TV with another video and today we're fishing two dams and today's challenge is to catch my pet bass on a shoelace yes you heard me right on a shoelace and uh, now I'm fishing with John today we're gonna be fishing two dams as I said we fishing Nigel dam and then we're gonna fish our club quarry later on um, and check how I catch that little bass on a shoelace that's a challenge I really want to challenge all of you guys to try it out trying to catch a bass on a shoelace anyway thanks a lot for watching and I'll see you guys now Chilky beat. later I'm on. I'm on. oh got him guys shoelace bass fishing challenge oh man don't fall off and if you guys don't believe me that really is a shoelace <laughs> oh I don't think I was gonna catch it and that is actually a fish tank fish as well so two videos in one guys completed the fish tank fish video part two here it is and the shoelace bass fishing challenge wow on a drop shot guys and <laughs> i didn't think it was going to be uh this easy i thought i was going to struggle the whole day but uh yeah i'm so happy let's get this little guy in the live well here we go let's get him in the live well Chilky B. Chilky B. No ways, no ways guys, <laughs> that's unbelievable, but this is also a fish tank bass, he has to come home, we'll call him spinner, because he's eating spinner more than three times his size, he's hooked really weird though, but uh, let's try and remove it without hurting him, there we go, let's put him in the live well guys. Lost. Ooh. Oh, nice. no, I'm still on. At last, guys, a decent fish after catching all the dinks. Ah. Don't click. Thank you, John. Wow, not a bad one. Not the biggest. Actually, he just handed me his whole complete setup and we're like, okay, let's have a little competition. He's giving me his setup and then he's gonna add a setup with a jerk bait. So yeah, this is like the, I think the third cast on his setup. And wow, what a fish guys. Just look at that on the little, well not little, but on the beautiful crankbait, which is really stuck. <laughs> there we go. All right, guys, I'm just gonna take a quick picture and then uh, release this beast. All right, guys, just a little update. Um, we've been catching some good fish here at the club dam. Um, yeah, I'm looking nice with the glasses. John is borrowing me some of his glasses. And it really makes a big difference. If you guys don't know the difference when you're fishing with, with glasses, just, just gotta try it. It really makes a big difference. Side fishing, wow. Um, but yeah, we're gonna keep fishing. And we've caught a few fish. We've uh, that, that we're thinking I'm putting in the fish tank. Um, I'm thinking of putting a few tilapia in as well, if we can catch some of them at the end of the day. But uh, at the moment, we're just enjoying the bass fishing, guys. And I hope you guys are enjoying it as well. Uh, but let's get back to a little bit more of fishing. Stay tuned. Ooh.
which is, oh, 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 right at the boat, guys. Wow, that was quite something. I don't know if I have that. Oh, damn, again. Oh, almost, almost released himself. But damn, that's another fish tank fish, guys. I think we're going to put all of them in the live well, then we can choose at the end of the video which one we're going to keep. But yeah, that one was on the shoelace. I'm kind of... I'm done with the shoelace. I caught the fish, I completed the challenge. So I'm done with the shoelace. I'm just catching them on, them on some spinner baits right now, and it's really going well. Uh, look at that little beautiful little bass. Uh, just off the spawn, so there's a lot of small ones. We caught a few dinks around, so we're going to keep fishing. And then after we're done fishing, we're going to decide which ones we're going to keep on. <laughs> there we go. Another little dink on the spinner. Okay, I won't be keeping him. Because I think we have enough. Uh, or maybe I should just, I uh, think, just let this little guy go. Wow, isn't that just a beautiful fish? Bass is such a beautiful fish, guys, on this big spinner. <laughs> I don't know how they choose to eat that. But uh, anyway, cheers, little guy. Cool of them. Let's get them out of the weeds. Damn, there's a whole school of them. Can you guys see them following? I don't know if you guys can, but uh, yeah, there's a bunch of them. I think this is probably the last fish for the day, but if it's not, I'm also happy. They're so small, but they're so fat. On the little baby bass fluke. Look at that, guys. Beautiful little fish, uh, mojo rigged, and uh, yeah, let's get a release on this guy. I'm on again. There we go. Three in a row, guys. Back to back. Literally, I'm not even joking. I caught one. John is busy with his fish right now. Look at that. And uh, here's another one from me. I mean, wow. This is just amazing. I mean, it's not huge fish, but I mean, they're healthy. They fight good. And anytime you're catching a fish, it's just amazing. But guys, uh, yeah, I'm kind of excited to get the pet bass in the, in the, in the fish tank. So stay tuned to that, eh? all right guys what a day um yeah this video may seem short to you and it seems quick but it was a long day um catching a lot of bears a lot of small ones but it was really really fun i'm heading home right now and then i'm gonna put the pet bass in the fish tank i think there's like seven or something so i'm thinking of putting the big ones in the bigger tank and then the smaller ones in the small tanks tank with some of my tilapia but um, i'm really excited to see to see them in there but anyway guys i'll see you guys in a few minutes well a few seconds for you guys but i'm about to drive home 45 minute drive and yeah let's get to it and get those pet bass in the fish tank stay tuned <music> Alright guys, I just got home. My first task is, this is going to be really hurry, so I have to do this quick because the fish has been in live well thing the whole day. I'm quickly going to be relocating these old guys of mine uh, to my tank in the living room. So yeah, Mika, can you please help me with the camera? First thing is to catch these guys. Uh, it's not really that easy. Or, oh, it's in and out. Okay, so the reason I'm putting these guys in this tank is because I don't want the bass to destroy them, we need to get those bass in that fish tank. I know there's too many, so I'm going to be releasing some of them soon, but stay tuned. 
That was pretty easy. All right, there we go. There's three. And yeah, I know this video is like all over the place, but I want to do this as soon as possible just to make sure they're okay. Damn, that is a big bass. All right, guys. So, okay, so the tank is, well, the lava was empty, so all the fish is in there. And I know there is way too much big bass in that fish tank right now. I mean, look at that. That's crazy. Um, I'm gonna have to release a lot of these guys soon. I'm thinking maybe keep two. I don't know what I was thinking when I was on, when I, while I was fishing, but this is too much bass and these bags, blah, these bass looks pretty big. But anyway, guys, so this spinner, you guys can see he's like a little golden bass. I really wanna keep him. But um, anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, smash the like button, comment what you guys thought, and please don't hate on me because I put so much bass in here. I am going to release them. I'll probably make a video about that too as well. Um, okay, guys, so I didn't really think that through. Um, I don't know what made me think that I can keep like seven bass in my tank, but yeah, that's crazy. Um, but I've decided that I'm going to let all the big ones go. Um, right now before it's too late and they die, but uh, they all look fine right now as you guys can see They really all look fine. They're healthy. None of them looks like they're gonna die But I, I, I don't want them to fight and start dying. So me and my friend Armand Yo, 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 he just got his new camera. I just got my Hero 6. I'm so happy about that But uh, we're gonna be taking the bass right now. It is pitch dark to the stream nearby just to save these guys because I, I feel pretty bad for taking them all home I don't know why I did it because in the live while well, they all looked so small and I just thought man my tank is huge but it really isn't compared to some of these bats so I'm gonna take them back right now if you guys want to see that stay tuned otherwise you can click out if you really want but anyway guys have a blessed night and enjoy Armand is on the roof he's recording everything so I'm gonna sync up the audio to that but uh, I just want to talk a little bit more about the the fish and stuff, uh, like I know a lot of people is going to be really angry at me for doing this. But I, I really think it's for the best. I, I know I've, I've made a mistake, but uh, this is really for the best to put them in uh, a stream or something. Because uh, they are really too big for a fish tank. And um, I, I need to re relocate them as soon as possible. Because if they recover and they start fighting, then all the small ones is going to die. And the big ones is just going to be in trauma and stuff. And all of the fish can potentially die. So um, I want to get all these fish safely. Well let them be safe and hopefully we can save them all um, I'll come back in a few days maybe and check out if all the fish is still alive well if I can see them they'll probably head downstream but uh, yeah I'm, I'm still really excited uh, for the for the for the pets um, if you guys want to name them give three random names and I'll choose which ones goes to who but uh, so far the one's name is definitely spinner as I said in the video because uh, he's just a spinner bass but um, yeah guys uh, we are actually at the place right now and yeah, yeah the stream is like right in front of us let's uh, let these bass go i'm really i'm really excited all right guys we are here let's get these big mamas uh, back into the water where they belong they definitely don't belong outside here all right guys all of them are in here as you guys can see very alive uh, there's four of them in there and then the rest of them is at home in the fish tank. But let, let's, let's let these guys go. I'm just going to throw the water in. Uh, th this should be fine. All right. Let's see if we can get some footage. There they go. Awesome. Awesome, guys. They're released. I think it's better this way. But uh, yeah. I think let's get back home and check how the fish tank looks. Stay tuned. Mm.